Okay, a little trellis on one side. One side, I got a little top up there. A little bit more. And I'll have Mama a little arbor a little bit better than the one I saw at Costco. Tell me I can't do it. Mr. Sue, what are you getting here? We're getting the rest of the trellis um, and the rest of the things we need to finish uh, the pergola that enters my garden area. All right, let's do it. Okay, got trellis on this side. Now it's time for this side to get trellis. So, got the trellis over here. Gotta cut her down, get her where she needs to be. And I got a few more slats up at the top up there. I'm gonna cut them next. Okay, in case you wanna know what size boards I'm putting on top is the roof over there. These are two by threes. And what I did, I measured it out. One board here is my guide. It's already been cut size of the ones that are on the top over there so I don't have to use a tape measure every time I just kind of line this one up and trace trace the line one here take it all the way down make sure it's flush on the end here and take my trusty pencil and trace yeah now I don't have to use a tape measure you just take it make your little line Move it to the next board, continue on. All right, yeah, as you can see, I got all my lines, all my lines all the way across. All I gotta do now is cut this bad boy and then we'll be hanging some roof, got a stain. Okay, we got the tape measure all stretched out. I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna make it 80 inches, 80 inches long, right there, all the way across. That's how long it's going to be. But now on the sides, it could be 43 and a half, and then it goes a little wider at the point. So what I'm going to do, to be precise, I'm going to go ahead and cut the length. And then after I cut the length, I'll go ahead and tack it up, and then just trim it off the sides. And I've ruined a picnic table under here. It's my stain table now, so I'm going to have to redo it. But I've got my top portions are all cut out and they're gonna have to be stained and after I stain and tack up I'm gonna have to clean up all right okay got my marks down there's one right there there's one there all the way across now what I'm gonna do is take this uh, leveler put it on the mark there right there and line it up with all the rest of them there trace across and that will be my cut for the length okay this is what I meant I got it tacked up on the top to the bottom and there's overhang here now the way I'm gonna do this instead of making sure that it didn't get wide or a little skinnier at the bottom and it didn't match up I'm gonna take my trusty jigsaw here and I'm gonna take it I'm gonna stay on this side of the pole and I'm gonna trim straight up the pole, all the way up the pole. That'll have a perfect fit each time. And then it's gonna be time for staining. All right, all right, this is the tedious part of the job, the staining, getting after it little by little. This is the part that I don't like, but it's gotta be done.
got stuff to do and she's already over here getting after it planting stuff I still got stuff to do I gotta tighten up on three of them up there on the top and do some staining and you're already getting after it what you planting there Strawberry. strawberries well I'll be I ain't even finished yet stuff still wet and you still out here getting after it yep. well my first arbor and there she goes now I know how to do one I can get it better take that Costco take that <laughs>